Pioneer Park for a little quickie because we're having extreme winds today, so I'm not staying. But what I want to do <clears throat> is see if you can fly the Mavic Air 2 without using a tele without using a phone. The telephone, I called it. <laughs> That's old school. Calling it a telephone. Right? Just like the rest of the Mavics or the rest of the DJI products, you could all fly them without using your phone. Let's see if we can do it with this one. Because I haven't tried it yet. And we'll see if it'll record any video and all that stuff too. So. Let me see if it gives me any kind of sign that I'm recording video. I'll hit this button here. So the front lights went out when I recorded the video, when I hit the video record. So let's try that again. So we'll start the video now. So they stayed off. So let's just try flying it a little bit, see how it goes. Seems nice, man. Uh Okay, there it goes. I don't know how high that is right there, but that's as high as it'll go without the phone attached. So it's, they've got it crippled just like the uh, Mavic Mini and the Spark. That was it right there, whatever that was, probably a hundred and look like 125 feet or something of that nature. So. So without any, so without you not having any telemetry or being able to see where it's at, <clears throat> or without any FPV, they got it crippled. See, the Mavic Pro, from what I remember, it's not like that because I flew that thing a little ways and it didn't uh, seem like it was crippled at all. But the Mavic Pro has telemetry on the screen. So you always have the screen to be able to guide you back home. So <clears throat> this you don't. So it's range limited without the phone, just like the other ones. So there you go. So at least you know that, right? Now, I'm not even going to try the, the distance because I know what's the point. Because you know it's going to be the same thing. If the height is crippled, the distance is going to be crippled also. There ain't no, there ain't no ifs, ands, or buts about that. Look at those trees those straight, say, straight across from me, how they're whipping around. I guess the wind hasn't gotten here yet. <laughs> it's working its way over here.
Man, I'll tell you what, guys. This thing flies as smooth as glass, man. This thing is smooth as butter. See, it pulls, it's pulling up on its own over there. I didn't pull that up, it stopped on its own. It must be seeing that berm coming up, so it's it's pulling up because it knows it's getting close to that berm over there. Alright guys, so there you see it. I don't think I ever tried the sport mode in this thing yet. Let me click that on. Let me look at the the roll here in the normal mode. Now let's put it in the sport mode and see what that does. Oh yeah, oh my goodness. Holy cow. Put it back in <clears throat> normal mode. I usually only fly the Anafi and the Bebop in the sport mode. Them two I usually fly in the sport mode all the time, but this, these DJI ones, usually I just use the normal mode. Usually that's fast enough. Yeah, yeah it flies fine without the phone, except you're just range limited. So that's the way it goes, right? No biggie. I don't think there is a, I'm not going to hit the return to home button. I'm just going to have to land it. I don't know if this grass is going to be an issue or not. Let me uh, cut the video. See what this Okay, so I chopped a couple blades of grass. It's not the end of the world, right? All right, guys, there you go. <sighs> Mavic Air 2. Yeah. It's a real beauty. <laughs>